Hi folks, it's uh, 9 February 2023 and we are here at the Dome at Sinayan Park. Uh, this is a new venue opened in the past year uh, and we're here to look at the uh, functional and technical aspects and evaluate it for various tours that are coming. Um, we'll look at the uh, Specifically, we want to see backstage accommodations, uh, the lighting system, sound system, uh, how many people it can accommodate, uh, specifically in this case for standing room only. Okay, I'm standing in front of what appears to be the main entrance. There's a door here and a door here. There's also another around the side. Let's take a look and see what's in. Oh yeah, yeah. The uh, floor capacity is 32 kilos per meter square. Huh? 350. Oh, 350 kilos per meter squared. Uh, they've brought automobiles in here for uh, for shows. And I think I mentioned this, but the the floor is cement. Okay, so the rental price is 125 million per day. 50% uh, for load-in days, excluding electric tax, um, permits, all the usual. Yes. Um, the total load capacity of the dome is two tons. We got mapping. Oh yeah. This is us. The map. Do you know how much the capacity per uh, for point rigging? Uh, like 2,000 divided by 32. So it's by 72? 32. 32. 32. What, about 80 kilos. Okay, and about 80 kilos per point. 80, yes. Point, uh, point capacity. Yeah, 32 points, rigging point. 32 rigging point. Okay, yeah, and uh, total capacity is 2 tons. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Uh, this is the apex there. That's nice. Yeah. Okay, so uh, there's hookup areas for the uh, gen sets over here and then another over in this area. Uh, the uh, internet access is right here, this little white box. Uh, so we can put uh, uh, mobile trailers here for dressing area and uh, office facility. There's nothing built into the, into the complex. Um, what else? Uh, there is air conditioning. Okay, so the center height on the dome is 15 meters. Uh, standing capacity is between 800 and 900. Uh, there are no dressing facilities. Um, there's minimal house lighting and sound. Uh, The dome doesn't appear to have a built-in grid. The floor is cement. And uh, there's no problem with like uh, using mist during, during performance. Uh, so the, the building is temporary and there's a small gap between the, uh, the bottom of the, of the structure and the floor. I think you can just see it there, uh, so water can drain out. Uh, when the doors are closed, there's full blackout. Uh, there's no direct loading dock. The containers would have to unload over that grassy hill and then roll the, the uh, stuff in or uh, use forklift to bring it in. 
The door appears to be about three and a half meters wide and maybe three meters tall. Uh, the bathroom facilities are external. Uh, there's no lobby or uh, box office. There is a large courtyard in the front where those facilities can be set up. Uh, going back to the tech rider, there are rolling dumpsters that can be positioned anywhere. Uh, from the main public entrance is probably 100 meters, maybe slightly less, to the to the main entrance of the dome. Uh, this wide open area here can be used for pre-show, box office, um, sponsored displays, etc. And over here, you notice a nice little lagoon. There's a retail area with cafes and restaurants. And just to give another look around, 